Hey everybody, this is Marcy Super on the Marcy Super Channel, and I have another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle for you. Sorry I've been a little inactive this week. It has been quite a crazy week. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, but I'm slowly trying to get back to having multiple videos this week. There won't be a topic video this week because I will be doing quite a few things actually this week. Ooh, God, I should have screamed. Let me take a picture right now. I'll be doing quite a few things. I'm actually getting prepared to do a top 10 list. I'm pre-prepping to do a top 10 list. So it's going to be a couple weeks before I do the, before the top 10 list comes out, actually. But do expect it. I am going to be quite having fun with it. And it would be one of those, like, it would be a top 10 that I don't see a lot of people doing. Um, more about it later. I do kind of want to give you guys this little, like, discussion video. If there's not, there's not going to be a topic discussion video on Wednesday, but there will be kind of this like vlog update up, <laughs> this vlog update style video for Wednesday, which I'm going to film like I always do, just to give you guys figure out what's going on with the channel. Um, I'm going to try to upload a little bit more. There should be two battles this week. Um, I think I'll be starting a new round of theme Thursday, but we are continuing our Pokemon New Beginnings battle challenge. If you guys want to join the team, I mean join the group, there's going to be a link down below for you guys to come and join. So we see the Blaziken first turn. Not something I'm super upset about, but I am going to set up the Toxic right now. The reason I say this is that one, Blaziken's fi um, fighting staff isn't going to do too much to us. I am expecting... Maybe a Brave Bird. There's also the Brave Bird. There's quite a few things actually. But we see the switch out. I'm expecting the Torco, but a we do not. We see the Volcanion switch in. Now the reason why I'm not too upset about the Volcanion switch in is because I'm gonna set up the Protect right now. See what Volcanion might be going for. I exp I've not played a lot of Volcanions before. But I am expecting to see some type of sludge wave. I don't think Volcanion has a lot of setup moves to um, predict the the um, the protect. But we are going to set up the rocks. I'm going to set up the protection. And we're going to see what he goes out. He does go for the sludge wave. So, good on my part. Um, Not a lot I can do right now. But I am going to switch out to Tornadus. Tornadus does have check moves. Tornadus does have the knockoff and U-turn and a Soap Vest attached to him. I kind of did some team planning before this. But I want to save Cafable because there is a Ravisman on his team on the form of Torkoal. And I don't want to deal with that. A lot of the fire types on his team except for maybe um, Blaziken and... Blaziken and, um, ooh, and, ooh, and Talonflame are special attackers. So I'm definitely going to go for the knockoff right now. Hopefully he'll switch out. Ooh, knockoff. We knock off a Soap Vest. So we see the Steam Eruption right now. That is stab, but it does just, oh, man, that burn is going to make it a two-hit KO. That burn is going to make it a two-hit KO. I'm definitely going to try to fire off a Hurricane. Tornadoes did me so much justice. Unless the Hurricane can knock out from this range. Or a Confusion. That works even better. Is he going to hurt himself through the Confusion? Yes. Perfect. I'm, I'm loving this already. So Tornadus is going to have a little bit more love on this team than originally thought. I am going to fire off a second Hurricane. Maybe he'll switch out and whatever it comes in gets hit with Hurricane. I don't know if he's going to lose his Volcanion too soon. I think I'm going to go pick up. Actually, I'm going to see if I can pick up a Volcanion for a team. We're going to fire off. And it misses. Is Confusion going to come through one more time? Yes, it is. Baby, I feel love tonight. Um, I don't see any real reason to keep torn. Actually, I do. Why? Really? 
<laughs> Three turns in a row! Three turns in a row! I could have just switched out and been perfectly alright. But three turns in a row, we cannot hit each other. I'm just going to do this classic samurai duel real quick. I wish I could have Roost on Tornadus, but I can't because Tornadus will lose its typing and it doesn't have Roost. Tur Hurricane hits? Yes. So we're just going to both miss out on our Mons. Burn's going to take me over. And now that his water immunity is done... Um... Yeah, that's his only water immunity. My other mods are going to be able to kind of run Havoc. The Doc is going to be able to run Havoc. Check moves. Hydro Pump, Spatial Ren, Earth Power, and Flamethrower. I'm actually going to send an LSP again. LSP is my go-to tank. I shouldn't have not... I should have not brought my... Um... I'm low-key mad. I shouldn't have brought in my Sable Eye this match. Because... Ooh! Gyro Ball! Kuflable Baby Girl! Yeah, she eats it up like a beast! And Leftovers is going to bring us back to a somewhat decent health. Um, I'm pretty sure Torkoal does carry the Rapid Spin. So, we, since we could somewhat have a little Spin Block right now in the form of Sableye, Rapid Spin is the normal move. It can't hit... It can't hit Sableye. Ooh, but we see the Overheat. Sableye is going to take that pretty well. Yes. Okay. So our defensive core is doing well. Once we get rid of this Torkoal, I think after Torkoal, there's no more tanks on his team. So we could proceed to sweep with the Doc. Let's see. We see the Gyro Ball. We see the Overheat. One of those moves has to be Rapid Spin. So I'm just going to go for the knockoff right now. Knockoff will get rid of that freaking pesky leftovers. Rapid Spin is not affected because of the ghost typing. Now what I could do is I could Toxic Stall. I don't want to move out. I need to put another move on Sableye. Just so we can, just so it can't do anything. I don't know what Torkoal's last move is, but we could just taunt for Shiggles. If he comes in with like Charizard, Charizard or Talonflame, they can't roost in. So he sends in the Fox. I I don't know why he brought the Fox in. I don't. Unless the Fox has Dazzling Gleam. Unless the Fox carries Dazzling Gleam, I can't see for a reason for him to bring it in. And it does carry Dazzling Gleam. Is that going to be enough to knock me out? <gasps> it leaves me with 8, eight to HP! Woo! Okay! Okay. That hurts. Ooh, that hurts. Good gosh, that low-key hurt. Sableye is just... Someone pointed out in my last battle when I figured out that my Pokemon... When um, I figured out someone knocked out somebody, someone was like, your face when um, the knockout happened. I'm going to recover right here. I expect Blaziken to use to protect this turn, but we can definitely taunt next turn to either prevent a second protection or a swords. Just go straight for the swords dance. I mean...
Okay, so this could be a problem. We could see the sweep starting to happen right now. I'm definitely going to knock off this Blaziken. Oh, no. We have a major problem now. <gasps> we... Oh, man. The knockoff was just too much. And Blaziken's speed boost is going to sit there and wall us. So, I do have a Choice Scarf, and I do have Earthquake. I could send an Ellis piece, Toxic, and Moonblast for neutral damage. So I'm going to shoot off the Toxic, and then I'm going to shoot off a Moonblast. It doesn't seem like it might have protection. It might be carrying Swords Dance, Flying Blitz, a Fighting Stab, and a Knockoff. And it seems like Blaziken is not Mega, so we can predict the Mega Charizard in some way or form. Um, if that is the case, I would I would not I would not know to say if it was Mega Charizard X or Mar Char Mega Charizard Y. If it's Mega Charizard X, I'm gonna have a standoff with it because I do have two Dragon types: one that does outspeed it because of Choice Scarf, and then we have the Dock. Oh, but he carries the Thunder Punch, so he might not carry the Fire Stab. So he may not carry the Fire Stab at this point. I mean, no, but he might not carry the Fighting Stab at this point. And we don't want Blaziken sitting here. Blaziken is going to outspeed everything right now, so it's not even a question of that. We can protect to see if we can get a little more HP off. Maybe he'll go for one more physical move. Hopefully he doesn't go for the Swords Dance. Good. If I knew what moves it had... So we know he has the knockoff. We know he has... the. I want to say it's the Fire Stat. Thunder Punch is going to knock me out from here. Not even the slightest of HP. Toxic is doing its work. I still have to worry about... I think he still has Twerkel. I don't think we knocked out Twerkel. So the Doc takes Neutral... I gotta remember that half of it is half. Thunder Punch isn't gonna do too much. We do have the knockoff. Knockoff might take out Garchomp. Um, I have Buff. Buff isn't gonna Buff isn't gonna be fun to use. I brought him just for the fact that I wanted to bring him out. Knockoff, Drain Punch, Mop Punch, Ice Punch. Check moves. Flamethrower, Earth Power, Spatial Run, Hydro Pump. I'm going to send a Garchomp and I'm going to use, I'm going to bring a Garchomp and I'm going to use a Dragon Stab. I'm going to go for the Outrage right now. Because if he switches out thinking that I'm going for an EQ, he or she, I think, I, I'm not completely sure. <laughs> I always, I always default using male pronouns for some reason. I'm so sorry for any females who I fight and I default to the male pronoun. I'm so sorry. Put Apology in the Wi-Fi Battle 102. He goes for the high jump kick. He goes for the high jump kick. So he doesn't have the fire stab. I need one more turn. I need one more turn. Actually, I don't. I don't need one more turn. I should have did this in the first place. I'm going to Mach Punch. I don't know why I didn't do this in the first place. I don't know far from why I, did, I didn't do this in the first place. Mach Punch did knock out. Blaziken has horrible defenses. Why didn't I do that in the first place? I would have saved Garchomp. So now we're stuck in a, like, a really tricky situation. He does have two flying types. And Torkoal.
But the, the stones dug in and a mock punch to knock out. So he's not going to be able to get rapid spin off. See, but I know for a fact that Talonflame carries a fire, I mean a flying stab. And at that point, I'm going to have to rely on Hydro Pump. We do know Charizard carries the Mega Stone. Yeah, we know Charizard carries the Mega Stone. So the question is, am I going to survive a Brave Bird from Talonflame? Because he's going to take half HP. He's under half. We see the citrus berry. Okay. We see the citrus. Ice punch does neutral. Knockoff does more because he ha he doesn't have a berry anymore. Drain punch does half. Mock punch does little. We're gonna go for the ice punch. And we see the acrobatics. Ooh, good. Ice punch is just my best bet. If we can go for a second one, it would be perfect. But I'm actually just going to go for... Gale Wings is faster. Okay. So the question is... How do I do this? How do we do this with the dock? We definitely... I might lose this. We're exerting pressure. We're, we're faster without priority. Spatial Wrench should knock out from that range unless he goes for a Roost. Hydro Pump is a definite knockout, but it's inaccurate. I'm going to go for the Spatial Wrench because I have the Power Boost. And it's more reliable. Is it? He goes for the Roost. Okay. We should have definitely went for the Hydro Pump. Because now he's basically at half HP. Fudge. If he goes for a second roost, we should knock out. If it hits. So he's gonna roost on me, okay. He's gonna roost on me. Spatial run just needs to hit. Come on, Doc. Really? Just go for the acrobatics. Just go for the acro acrobatics. Okay, go for acrobatics, please. Doc, you're my man. Doc's is my man. Good job, buds. So now we deal with Charizard. We deal with the Charizard. He's already going to start off at half HP. So the question is, is he Mega X or is he Mega Y? Because both carries roots. Spatial Rent, if he's if he's Y, Sun's going to have the power of Hydro Pump. If he's X, Spatial Rent's going to hit for super effective. If he goes for the roost, we just got to see. We got to see what the mech, it's X. So we just got to hope that spatial ring connects at this point because we should be faster yes super effective spatial ring this was close yes we got the second two gems so far guys this was a good one i did misplay but this was such a good battle if you guys like this Wi-Fi battle, if you like the fact that we're throwing ubers into the ou mix make sure you hit this video with a like there will be a talking video on Wednesday where I talk about a little bit of stuff and 30 Thursday if you guys want the Thursday make sure this hits if this hits five likes I'll definitely make sure that this battle challenge of ours is on Monday and theme Thursday is on Thursday if not let me know in the comments below if you want the, the OU in the mix type of battles or you want me to go back to theme Thursday because I can whip up the generation five team real quick guys this is Mars King Super and the Mars King Super channel in the Mars it not out yet. Guys, make sure you go watch last week's videos. The Mars is out.